The Umrah Arabic, Umrat is an Islamic pilgrimage to Mecca, Hiyas, Saudi Arabia, performed by Muslims that can be undertaken at any time of the year, in contrast to the Hajj Arabic, ha which has specific dates according to the Islamic lunar calendar. In Arabic, Umrah means, to visit a populated place. In the Sharia, Umrah means to perform tawaf round the Kaaba Arabic, Ka, Ba T cube, and Sai between Safa and Marwa, both after assuming Iram a sacred state. Iram must be observed once traveling by land and passing a makat like Zu El Hulafa, Jaffa, Karnu El Manazil, Yalamlam, Zat I Irq, Ibrahim Mersha, or a place in Al Hill. Different conditions exist for air travelers, who must observe Iram once entering a specific perimeter about the city of Mecca. It is sometimes called the minor pilgrimage or lesser pilgrimage, the Hajj being the major pilgrimage which is compulsory for every Muslim who can afford it. The Umrah is not compulsory but highly recommended. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Differences between the Hajj and Umrah. Both are Islamic pilgrimages. The main difference is their level of importance and the method of observance. Hajj is one of the five pillars of Islam. It is obligatory for every Muslim once in their lifetime, provided they are physically fit and financially capable. Hajj is performed over specific days during a designated Islamic month. However, Umrah can be performed at any time. Although they share common rites, Umrah can be performed in less than a few hours while Hajj is more time-consuming, and involves more rituals. Types of Umrah A certain type of the Umrah exists depending on whether or not the pilgrim wishes to perform Umrah in the Hajj period, thus combining their merit. When performed alongside the Hajj, Umrah is deemed one of enjoyment Umrat al and is part of a fuller Hajj of enjoyment More precisely, the rituals of the Umrah are performed first, and then the Hajj rituals are performed. Otherwise, when performed without continuing to perform Hajj, the Umrah is considered a single Umrah Umrah Mifrata. Topic: <inaudible> Rituals. The pilgrim performs a series of ritual acts symbolic of the lives of Ibrahim Abraham and his second wife Hajar and of solidarity with Muslims worldwide. Pilgrims enter the perimeter of Mecca in a state of Iram and perform Tawaf Arabic, twa, which consists of circling the Kaaba seven times in an anti-clockwise direction. Men are encouraged to do this three times at a hurried pace, followed by four times, more closely, at a leisurely pace. Sai Arabic, Sai which means rapidly walking seven times back and forth between the hills of Safa and Marwa. This is a reenactment of Hajar's frantic search for water. The baby Ismail Ishmael cried and hit the ground with his foot some versions of the story say that an angel scraped his foot or the tip of his wing along the ground, and water miraculously sprang forth. This source of water is today called the Well of Zamzam. Halq or Taxer, Taxer is a partial shortening of the hair typically reserved for women who cut a minimum of one inch or more of their hair. A Halq is a complete shave of the head, usually performed on men. Both of these signify the submission of will to God over glorifying physical appearances. The head shaving, cutting is reserved until the end of Umrah. These rituals complete the Umrah, and the pilgrim can choose to go out of Iram. Although not a part of the ritual, most pilgrims drink water from the well of Zamzam. Various sects of Islam perform these rituals with slightly different methods. The peak times of pilgrimage are the days before, during and after the Hajj and during the last ten days of Ramadan. Topic. History According to the Muslim traditional accounts, access to the holy site, and thus the right to practice the Hajj and Umrah pilgrimages have not always been granted to Muslims. It is reported in the Muslim traditional accounts that throughout Muhammad's era, the Muslims wanted to establish the right to perform Umrah and Hajj to Mecca since the latter had been prescribed by the Quran. During that time, Mecca was allegedly occupied by Arab pagans who used to worship idols inside Mecca. The Treaty of Hudaybiyah 
In the early days of Islam, it is claimed that tensions arose in Mecca between its pagan inhabitants and the Muslims who wished to perform pilgrimages within. According to the traditional Muslim stories, in 628 AD 6 AH, inspired by a dream that Muhammad had had while in Madinah, in which he was performing the ceremonies of Umrah, he and his followers approached Mecca from Medina. They were stopped at Hudaybiyah, Quraysh a local tribe refused entry to the Muslims who wished to perform the pilgrimage. Muhammad is said to have explained that they only wished to perform a pilgrimage, and subsequently leave the city, however the Quraishites disagreed, diplomatic negotiations were pursued once the Muslim prophet Muhammad refused to use force to enter Mecca, out of respect to the holy Kaaba. In March, 628 AD, Dual 6 A, the Treaty of Hudaybiyah was drawn up and signed, with terms stipulating a ten year period free of hostilities, during which the Muslims would be allowed a three day long access per year to the holy site of the Kaaba starting the following year. On the year it was signed, the followers of Muhammad were forced to return home without having performed Umrah. The first Umrah The next year, 629 AD, or 7 AH, the Muslim tradition claims that Muhammad saw ordered and took part in the conquest of Mecca in December 629. Following the agreed-upon terms of the Hudaybiyah Treaty, Muhammad and some 2,000 followers men, women and children proceeded to perform what became the first Umrah, which lasted three days. After the transfer of power, the people of Mecca who, according to the Muslim traditional narrative, had persecuted and driven away the early Muslims, and had fought against the Muslims due to their beliefs, were afraid of retribution. However, Muhammad forgave all of his former enemies. Ten people were forvij, and not to be killed after the capture of Mecca, Ikrima ibn Abi Jal, Abdullah ibn Sa'd ibn Abi Sar, Habar bin Aswad, Mikiyas Sabab Alaythi, Huwarath bin Nukaid, Abdullah Halal and four women who had been guilty of murder or other offences or had sparked off the war and disrupted the peace. See also Arabian Peninsula Great Mosque of Mecca Middle East The First Pilgrimage List of Expeditions of Muhammad Umrah Visa Policy Umrah Package UK Topic External links Health Guidelines for Hajj and Umrah Umrah, The Do's and Don'ts. Umrah, Step-by-Step -step Umrah Guide Difference between Hajj and Umrah Umrah Guide Step-by-Step -step.